Hello community! Today we look at the Cohere platform, a completely new AI platform. They have a product launch and they have introducing their chat AI with the retrieval augmented generation with Rack. That was a topic in my last video and we will play around here with Cohere Coral as they're called here, their chat with Coral plus the retrieval augmented generation engine. So let's dive right into it. And here we are, Cohere, as I just noticed here, introducing chat with retrieval augmented generation, RAG. September 28, 2023, the Cohere team, product launch. Beautiful, let's have a look at this. So Cohere says, we're excited to announce that our chat API Riff Rack is now available in a public beta. New capabilities can integrate user input, data sources, and model generation to build powerful product experience. API is powered by Command, Cohere's flagship generative LLM. Beautiful. We also have access to the Coral Showcase, a demo environment that previews how these capabilities can be made available. So first things first, we chat now with Coral. Remember, Cohere, Coral, beautiful. We have here the integration with Rack, the grounding, the community dashboard. Search the web or give me a task. And we simply say, search the web for the latest insights in AI and its application. So let's have a look what it can now connect to the internet and come back. I, okay, okay. So the answer is, I cannot provide specific sources for the latest insights in AI and its application. However, I can provide some information on the matter. AI is being used in a wide variety of industries, healthcare, finance, okay. In finance, AI is being used to provide personal services. In security, AI is being used to develop image and facial recognition system. So honestly, this is not what I was looking for because yeah, this was not really famous. So let's do something else. I go here with the example and they say, tell me about the market for solar panels in the United States of America. So here we go. Now we have a deep diving. And now since this is an official example per Cohere Carwell, here we have now an answer generated, beautiful. And as you can see, we have here two references, three references, solar PV panel market size and here the United States. Okay, so we have here external references where they can extract this information. So not about AI, but something similar. So let's give here specific Cohere, Coral, so RAG implemented chat functionality here, uh, the latest example and we will do tell me about the ai market in europe and its eu regulation for ai commercial systems let's see what we get there's a deep diving by coral core here and we get okay 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 yeah a little bit longer very nice and we have one reference two reference mckinsey mckinsey and brookings the Digital Markets Act, yeah. So, okay, this works. So if we have something more on the legislative side, if you have market data, it works. If we just say the latest insights in AI, okay, not really, no specific sources here for this part. So here you have Cohere Coral. Now let's do a little bit of theory and then we jump here right into the Cohere Playground and Yes, we are transferring the data. And it, yes, you can see here again, we have the chat with Coral. Then we can generate something, classify something, embed something. Maybe we have a look at a summarization. So what are the parameters? Yeah, but this I show you after the next minutes of theory. Easy conversation. Have the power to integrate chat directly in your application. Dynamic experience. Yes, yes, yes. Using RAG, this is about what I'm interested in, building user trust. Retrieval augmented generation or RAG can help generative models 
build trust with users, improve the relevance and accuracy of generative AI by incorporating information from data sources, external data sources that were not part of the pre-trained LLM models. Beautiful. So chat API is now RAG enabled, meaning developers can inform models generation with information from external data sources, what we know as data stores or vector databases. A leap forward for generative AI accuracy, verifiability, and timeliness. Okay. In the public beta, developers can connect command to a web search, which just it is, or you can give it some documents and it searches the text and the documents. So how does it work? Citations allow users to verify the response of a message. What is our return policy? Goes here in the data source, finds here the document in the database and says, can be returned within 30 days and gives you the citation of your company specific data, the, the file number or the file name where your policy is formalized. Example of how a chat API with Rack can be used to generate verifiable responses with citation. This is great, more relevant, more timely, okay, more accurate. This is interesting, okay? Yeah, I will show you this in the Coral. Beautiful. Can be used as an Android system or modular components. We have the document mode, specify the documents you want the model to use. Query generation mode, scenarios where it rather get the search queries, the model recommends instead of actual replies. And a connector mode specifies the location of where the model should look for information. Developer documentation, yeah, let's have a look there. The developer documentation, here we go. Retrieval augmented, yes, yes, yes. Let's make it a little bit bigger. What does make make possible? Reduces the problem by giving the model source material to work with. Okay. The user can directly provide context for each document to grant the replies as in a vector database. Yes. Okay. And you will have citation. It will show you exactly which sources it used. How can I use rack? Beautiful. Yes. This remote document mode, query mode, connector mode. Yes. Beautiful. So document mode, you provide a document with this and the information will be extracted from the document, message, document, title, punctuation, output. Okay, this is everything we know already. Snippets, yes, utilize the document, beautiful, yes, beautiful. Chat beta, yes, beautiful. Command, everything in the playground, yes. Very generation mode, so. We say, what are the tallest penguins on earth? We have a search query, tallest penguin, and it uses a web search engine. Wow, congratulations. And we get back the tallest penguin or whatever. Okay. Chat beta in the playground, chat with coral parameters, citation quality. Okay, in connector mode. Point the model to the source it should be using. Okay, so. Web search connector is a web search. Great. An example ID is web search. Output looks like this. Chat playground. Yes, okay. The chat playground. What are some of the recent news about the North American tech job market? Okay, let's have a look at the playground. So here we are now in the Cohere Playground. We are now Playground, and I have here this summarization engine that is still in beta. So we have examples for some transcript summarization, article summarization, and blog post summarization. What else we can do? Blog post. I go here with the official example by Cohere. Let's give them a try. As I understand, what is this about? Cohere is now available on Amazon SageMaker. So we have here three, four, para five, six, para seven paragraphs, and then a conclusion. And we say, let's do a summarization. Beautiful. The length we have long. The format will be, yeah, let's go with auto, you know, advanced parameters. The model is a command. Yeah, that's good. 
extractiveness is high. The temperature lets be creative. Additional focus on action points, write additional commands for summarization. And I say focus on clear explanation. And we say run. So here we have now on the Cohere Playground a summarization task. And here we are. Now we have here one paragraph extracted. Cohere has made state of the art language AI available on Amazon SageMakers. Developers can now deploy Cohere's pre trained generation language models through the service. Amazon SageMaker is used by developers to build, train, and deploy machine learning models. Okay, Cohere's medium generation model is also on SageMaker, is designed for use on tasks that require quick responses, such as question answering and paraphrasing. Beautiful, has a low latency inference on AWS hardware and offering a choice of cost and performance option for SageMaker customers. So our five, six paragraphs have been reduced to one paragraph and we followed here the official Cohere Playground example. Now you have an idea about Cohere. Would be great to see you in one of my next videos where we explore more AI models.